everyone, Arlen here. Welcome back to my Country Craft Corner. How in the world are you guys doing today? It is so good to see you again and thank you so, so much for stopping back by to see what I'm up to. And what I'm up to, well, first of all, I'm trying to video so that I can load this straight to YouTube. So I'm trying to do that because I am super duper duper busy over here. Uh, I just got my home tour up and uh, scheduled for Saturday. My cozy corners up and scheduled for tomorrow morning and I'm wor starting to work on my subbies cozy corner video. So excuse any mistakes that I make. I'm not going to be able to edit myself up. Uh, edit myself. <laughs> See, there we go. Uh, but I did want to bring you a quick haul. I went out yesterday. I had gotten a charming, Char Kristen had gotten me a charming Charlie's gift card for Mother's Day along with a home goods uh, card. And I wanted to show you what I picked up with both of those things. Plus, I went and got my nails done. There's my nails for this time around. You'll get sick of seeing them, you know, because I don't go but about once a month. I try to go once a month so but I really like the pink and I want a little something different than the pink and white and then there's another thing I bought check out that thumb ring I got that from Charming Charlie's and I thought that was super cute it's a little it's wide but I like it so but first of all let me I'll show you what else I got from Charming Charlie's in a second uh, I also want to announce what creators are going to be uh, putting up videos tomorrow so that of the of their cozy corner. I wanted to be sure to give you a list. I don't think I had ever made a video to do that. I have been so stinking busy with my patriotic decor and I just hadn't had time. So anyway, let me do my little haul first. It's not going to take but just a minute. And then I'm going to go through the list of names, list of creators. And also too, I've gotten like I think I had said to Dell or somebody in an email last night that I had like 42 of you subbies who are participating. In reality, it's about, I want to say around 35 to 38 of you, which is awesome. And I wanted to let you know that I'm only probably going to be putting one picture of, I know some of you sent me multiple pictures. If you sent me two cozy corners, I'll put one of each of those cozy corners up. And most of you only sent me one, but it's going to be, I don't know how long the video is going to be. I'm going to be doing editing, of course, and transitions and things like that. Uh, but I wanted to let you know that I'm just going to be putting one of your pictures up of your cozy corner. If you sent me two, that's fine. I'll do one of each, you know, but I just want to let you know that too. I don't want anybody's feelings to be hurt. If you know you sent me three or four pictures and I only put one up, I don't, you know, I just want to be fair across the board. You guys know me. I'm honest. I'm straightforward. And I just want to let you know about that because I don't want, I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings. <laughs> Never, ever, ever want to hurt anybody's feelings. <sighs> anyway, okay, got that out. <laughs> Uh, I think I have heard back from all of you subbies who said it was okay to use your first name and I will be just using your first name and maybe last initial, you know, uh, but other than that, that's all I'm going to be using. I'm not going to be using first and last names. It's not necessary, I don't think. And, you know, for those of you who watch me all the time, you're going to know who's who as I go through the video. Uh, anyway, to my home goods haul here, I... Uh, wanted a new runner for my dresser in here. I'm going to, I'm not, I'm not going to be doing this on camera or anything, but I'm going to be going through, uh, you know, and, and doing a little bit of a clean out for some of my old jewelry. You know how some of it kind of gets that odd feeling to it. I'm going to give some to Goodwill. I'm going to, you know, and I'm, and I got myself a couple of jewelry boxes that are coming from Amazon. And I'm going to be consolidating my jewelry and all that. So I wanted to get a new table runner. So I picked up, y'all remember this, I got this for my Pioneer Woman to go on my kitchen table. They still had another one left in there, so I went ahead and got it. Uh, and it was, what does that say, $12.99. $12 so I went ahead and picked it up. And I'm going to put this on my dresser and be able to, you know, go through all of that. I've got some of my mom's jewelry yet that I've really never gone all the way through. And I just need to get myself organized in there. It's kind of driving me crazy. I've been so busy that I, things have kind of just been thrown in and it's discombobulated and it needs to be organized. <laughs> 
And in the same vein, although I might bring you along for this one if you're at all interested. I don't know whether you would be interested or not. But I, underneath my sink, in, my bath, in the master bathroom, you know how things just kind of pile up in there. I've got makeup. I've got extra shampoos. I've got powders. I've, I don't know what all I have under there. But I thought I would go ahead and get me some organizing tools so that I could get myself underneath that sink and get to organizing underneath there. It drives me nuts that I cannot, uh, that it's just all sitting in there, you know, and I've got some makeup in bags. You know how you get your, uh, your sample bottles, you know, at least I do from Clinique. I get samples. I've got bunches of samples. I've got makeup I haven't used yet. I've got makeup from the cruise ships. I've got extras. So, <laughs> I've got extra hair gels, I've got extra hair, you know, it's just a mess in there. So I bought me some, a couple of these, they were yep, $7.99 a piece, and they're just, you know, little baskets, and I'm sure you could take these little baskets out, I didn't, I don't have my scissors out here, and use the, you know, the one for, you know, one thing, bigger things, and then maybe, you know, whatever for whatever, extra lipsticks, I, you know, I never wear fingernail polish anymore. I always go and get my nails done, like I said, just once a month. But I've got 500 uh, fingernail polish bottles that I need to get rid of because they've been in there for years. So anyway, I got two. So that is all I got from Home Goods. I'm not shopping for any decor right now, obviously, because I'm finished. So I am just trying to take some time now to get myself organized and get myself feeling a little bit better about that kind of stuff. I don't know about those of you who are organized, and if you if you know of a place that's getting messy because you're busy concentrating over here, but somewhere else has gotten messy, it's it's like pulling at me. You know how I always say you don't want anything. I'm usually talking about health wise. You don't want anything pulling or you know bad news wise or struggles in life. You know when I talk about don't let anything. I hope that nothing is pulling at your mind or your heart. That's what I'm talking about with that. But this kind of thing tugs at my mind. You know it just tugs at me. Going Arlen, it's a mess underneath that sink. You need to go and fix that. Or Arlen, you don't need all that fingernail polish back there. What are you doing? Give it to the kids. Give it. You know. So, I need to get myself organized or I'm going to go a little crazy. <laughs> so then, after I was done at Home Goods, Kristen also got me a card from Charming Charlie's. So, I went over to Charming Charlie's and like I said, I bought this little ring, which I thought was super cute. And I can wear it on, you know, I bought it big enough so it would fit on, you know, whatever figure. Not that I wear rings on every figure, but I do love a thumb ring. No reason to wear a thumb ring other than I just like the way it looks. So I got that, and then I just got a couple of necklaces. And I didn't even think about this. I could have worn this today with this little top I have on, but I have a lot of, a good many tops with this color, with that green color. But I thought that was super pretty, with the, especially if you have like a V-neck top, you know, and have it cascading down like that. I thought that was pretty. So I picked up that, and it was, uh, $15. So I thought that was pretty. And then, just one more thing. And that's it, you guys. So, but I thought this was really pretty. You know that little black necklace I wear like every other day? <laughs> you guys are probably really sick of seeing it. I thought this might serve as a cute uh, substitute for that. And I thought it was super pretty. And you know me, I like a little bit of bling happening. So I thought that was pretty. And it has earrings to match. I really like these earrings too. Oh, let me tell you a story. You see how small the little the the little thing is that sticks in, you know, that goes right in your ear. When I first got my ears pierced as like I was 12, I had to wait until I was I think 12 or 13, turning 13. I went to a jewelry store to get them done. And the, at that time, they put needles through your ears. Well, the guy, it was a guy who did it. When he did it, he didn't do it right. And, sorry, my necklace is talking to you there. Sorry about that. Uh, he didn't do it correctly. And I had one, the hole in this ear was where it should have been, and the hole in this ear was up. So I never, my earrings never hung right. And I was like, you know, as a teenager, you wait so long to have something done, you know? And then I went in and had it done, and he did it wrong. 
So I went years and years and years with it like that until after I was married, you guys. And one day I was walking through the mall here in town and I said, I am going to go to, I think it was Claire's at the time where they, you know, they just had the uh, gun that they put pierced ears with. And I went in there and I said, honey, look at my ears. And she went, oh, you're a little crooked. I went, yeah, you think? And I said, do you think you could fix that? Just put me a hole further back this way on this ear and further forward on this ear, whichever way it was. I can help you. And she did. She gave me two pierced ears. And for a time, I looked a little odd because, you know, you have your starters in there, whatever. But since then, I've been even. But my ear, my holes in my ears are, they had to be close together. So therefore, if I wear an earring with a big fat, you know, with this part being big and fat, this little part here being big and fat, it covers up my other ear. So I always try to be careful when I'm buying earrings to buy earrings that have just a little tiny post on the front like that so that they'd be sure to fit. There you go. Probably something you didn't know about me. Not that you wanted to know, <laughs> but I told you anyway. So that's why I, bought, I try to find earrings with little, you know, and I do wear some that, you know, I'll just take the back earrings out, but I hardly ever remove. These are just cubic zirconia. I hardly ever remove those. But anyway, there's my earring saga. <laughs> So that's it for my whole haul, haul, whole haul. Can you believe it? That is all I bought. Uh, and I spent my wad. I spent my wad what she uh, what she gave me, and I didn't really spend money over what she gave me, which I was proud of myself for, uh, because I just wanted to be able to show her this is what I got. And she's an organizer too, so she'll be thrilled I got stuff to organize. I think she's been complaining about it. When we go on vacation, she uses our bathroom, you know. And she said, Mom, you think you could clean on, out underneath your sink? Oh, I know, Kristen. Feel free if you want. She's very organized. So, anyway. I did want to tell you that I spent Saturday, all of Saturday, Saturday afternoon, it was raining and thunderstorming, and it was a terrible day here. So I had been neglectful of my P.O. Box beautiful uh, notebook, you know, that Kristen made up for me. And I had not filed everything. So I took a, a, all afternoon on Saturday and I actually got everything filed. And y'all know what? I need to buy myself another notebook. I, I filled that whole notebook up and I need to get more inserts and I need to get more file folding. Thing, you know, the things that Kristen got me to make little tabs with your names on them. Those of you who have sent me something. So that's what I did on Saturday. I got that all organized. So I'm like, I'm on this organizing kick here, trying to get myself uh, back into shape. <laughs> but anyway, here I am um, looking at my computer here and I've got a list of the creators. Now creators, if you're watching this today, let me know, make sure that you tell me if I have forgotten to say your name, if I have forgotten or I missed a comment that you said you wanted to participate or anything like that, please comment below and let me know. And I will be sure to add your name to my playlist. I will be putting up a playlist. It's going to be my playlist and as you guys put your videos up tomorrow, creators, I am going to add your link to my playlist. And my playlist will be, subbies, will be in my, in my description. And as, as they put them up, I should be around most of the day in and out tomorrow. So as soon as I see them put up, I will add the link into my playlist, okay? So that's the way it's gonna, my playlist is gonna work. And then, of course, you all can give a link all you uh, creators can give a link to that playlist if you want to. You feel free if you would like to do that. Or you can give a link to all of these pages too. Uh, right now, I, I'm a very, let me see, I'm trying to think, do I have you listed in my video? I don't know, you guys, if I did that. I think I just am going to do, as you put your videos up, I'm going to add them to my playlist. So... All right, here we go with the creators. I've got, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And as I said, if there's anybody else who is going to be putting up a cozy corner tomorrow, creators, that I have don't have, when I don't say your name, let me know, please, so I can be looking and making sure that I have you all in my playlist tomorrow. So here we go. Kim over there at Sweet Daisy Creations. Ms. Davida Lane. Holiday Cookie Diva. Tracy at Holiday Cookie Diva. 
Holly at Living at Country, Manji Housewife, RJ Mailer, Mike and B's Life, hope I said that right, Clara and Christina, Two Blessed, the number two, Blessed, Rizart, Rich, Creative Laurie, Laurie M. Wood, Laura, excuse me, M. Wood, Organized by Darcy, Organizing Made Easy, I should watch her channel, shouldn't I, <laughs> and Deco Easy. So there you go. That is, those are all the creators who I think have gotten in touch with me. Creators, if there's anybody else out there and you want to uh, add a cozy corner, please do it. But tomorrow at some point, subbies again, let me say, uh, and then let me know that you've done it if you are not on this list. Or if you can comment below, let me know that you're going to put one up and I will add you to my playlist and be watching for you. And if I don't have your name and you think you or you uh, you said you told me or you told me or whatever and I messed up and I didn't see it please forgive me and I am not perfect <laughs> and I could very well have have accidentally not seen your 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 comment or whatever you know so just be sure to let me know this evening that's one of the reasons why I'm wanting to put this up this evening so I do not want to miss anybody again I don't want to ever hurt anybody's feelings ever 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 and uh, subbies, a reminder that I need your one picture, if you don't mind, one picture of your cozy corner. You know, those who have not sent me a picture yet and who want to participate and want to be highlighted in my video, I have a 5 o'clock, 5 p.m. deadline by tomorrow, tomorrow, June the 6th, by 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, my time. I need to have one picture of your cozy corner sent to me. So... There we go. I think that's it. I think that's all I wanted to uh, to say. I hope that all is well with everyone. I've got the light on behind the camera and I'm being blinded by the light here. <laughs> I just looked at my computer. You know, when they take a picture and you're, all you see is spots, that's what I'm seeing. But anyway, I think that's all I wanted to bring you. I will be back uh, tomorrow with my cozy corner and then very soon on its tails tomorrow evening or Thursday at some point. I'm hoping I'll have the subbies video up, cozy, subbies, uh, cozy corner video up. And then I will do one live this week, uh, two o'clock on Friday. And I think I am going to try to stick with just Friday lives moving forward. I know there are a lot of you who have been missing out on some of my crafting and stuff who are used to me doing regular videos. So I think I will be trying to split the difference here and do my Friday live for all of you lovelies who, who join me in my lives. And then I will be doing just regular videos, you know, during the week. So I think that's a good compromise. Again, I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings or leave anybody out in any way so my emotions are right here today can you tell what's new huh <laughs> okay i think that's it and i am rambling and yammering on and on and on so i'm going to close this one out and just say as i always do uh anybody out there with any is suffering with a catastrophic illness or chronic pain please know that you're in my thoughts and my prayers every day and uh, again, for those who you know might have something, I hope that there's nobody out there who has something that pulling on their mind or their heart, pulling your attention away from where it should be or where you want it to be. And with that, I'll just say, keep an eye out for my cozy corner video to go up first thing tomorrow morning, Eastern Standard Time. And then watch for everybody else's too. Whenever they come into the time zone, you know, watch for those videos to come up and enjoy them. I know that the creators are going to make awesome cozy corners. And you subbies have done a fabulous job. Oh my goodness. I cannot wait to get that video up. You guys did great. I'm so touched and humbled. Anyway, with that... <laughs> I'm just going to say until next time, tomorrow, y'all take good, good care. Bye-bye.